Hi Rock Point, I'm Michelle. My home group recently just started doing a prayer devotional that we share all together. We take a few verses that the Lord has been speaking to us and reference um, other scriptures and then turn it into a prayer. It's been so amazing to see the impact that it's been making with our group. By doing this weekly, it has us engaged more in the word, it, ha it has us learning more about each other, and it guarantees us at least one night of prayer each week. If you lead a home group or a small group of any kind, my husband, I encourage you to give it a try. So here's an example. I took Romans 8.28, which says, And we know that for those who love God, all things work together for good. For those who are called according to his purpose. And so I reference a few verses, which is 1 Corinthians 8.3. But if anyone loves God, he is known by God. In 1 John 4.21, it says, In this commandment we have... From him, whoever loves God must also love his brother. And in Jude 1 21, it says, Keep yourselves in the love of God, waiting for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ that leads us to eternal life. So I took that scripture and turned it into a prayer, which is, Lord God, I praise you first for everything and everyone that you have blessed me with. I am undeserving of your love, but yet you still love me anyway. I do love you, God. You know me, Lord, but help me get to know you more. Create that desire in me like when I first invited you into my life. Because you love me, I know I must love others, but I am a sinner and I need you to help me show the love of your son through through me by giving, me my, giving my brothers and sisters grace, mercy, and compassion. I am a servant leader and I want you to fill me with purpose of your will, not mine. Help me align my choices in direction that will please you and further your kingdom. In your most heavenly name, amen.